Now we're fucking recording. Alright, cool. Man, these are gonna be some low fucking quality videos, but it's okay because I'm, I'm starting out. It, you boy. Sup, so, I'm gonna do a video on silica gel because, uh, reasons. So a while ago, uh, we were playing with some of these bags because, you know, you're not supposed to. And um, I got to wondering why it always says, do not eat. That's actually wet now, interesting. So of course, I went to Google, um, and it turns out the reason um, that they say do not eat is not because they are toxic. Quite the opposite, in fact. It's because they are so non-toxic that they are often included with food. And so in order to make sure that you don't eat them because they're in your food, they explicitly say, throw away, do not eat. Thing is that inside of here is silica gel, which is silica, which is sand. Um, sand doesn't actually do anything to you, so it's completely safe to eat. So the thing about silica gel is that it's incredibly porous and has like a really high surface area, meaning that water vapor is more inclined to condense on it rather than the environment. Which is basically how it just traps water, and apparently it can trap over 40% of its own weight in water. So what I was interested in is, I have a lot of plants. I have a lot of plants. And they're always drying up. So why not grow plants in the thing that pulls water in from the environment? Now clearly, um, this isn't going to be enough to grow a plant in. So I went online and um, I bought some more. You guys like my unboxing video? How not to fucking cut, by the way. I'm currently cutting toward my own arm, so, you know. It's, it's okay. Local engineer struggles with box. Time! Sorry, cat. This is a... Oh, it's canned. Look at that. I'll just do B-roll. Oh, Jesus. I'm just uh, gonna appeal to my Tumblr fans by using a Tumblr. It's a Valentine's one. I don't ever actually drink Valentine's. Alright, we have ourselves a glass full of desiccant. Um, and to further show you that you can safely eat this, let me just get some of that. That is extremely dry. Holy fuck. It's like... Ah, uh, it's like stuck to my tongue. Hold on, I'm gonna show you this shit again. Okay, let me just... Ooh, this is pretty personal, huh? It's like... It's like infinitely stuck on my... Oh, I, I stuck on my lip. <laughs> Holy fuck! <fit>, look. <laughs> I think I'm starting to figure out why it says do not eat. Oh my god. That's like... That's like duct tape to my fucking... Taste buds. That is fucking awesome! <laughs> So yeah, now that we have a glass full of the dry shit ever, and my cats aren't actively going to choke on it anymore, let's uh, find ourselves a plant to put in here. <sighs> plant. Got myself these two cuttings that uh, fell off of a plant. Mysteriously. I wonder why. I'm just going to cut these off and uh, plonk them in there. See what happens. I'm gonna just try this one because it's slightly longer. Now this is clearly gonna dry the whole plant out, which is the opposite of what we want, so let me add some water to this and uh, see what's up. They always return to the scene of the crime, huh? Alright, so, 
Now that I have some um, water, let's, uh, let's do this shit. Whoa! What? <laughs> Jumping out of there. What fucking popcorn? That is fucking cool. Holy shit. That is still going. Look at this shit. So there were a lot of things I expected. Um, violently exploding popcorn was not one of them. Oh, what the hell? It's like hot, it's warm. What? This whole glass is hot to the touch. What is going on? I just boiled my plant. I don't think it's going to be okay. That is crazy. Okay, I'm going to have to figure out why that gets hot. And, um... I'm going to have to do some more experiments. Because this shit is fucking nuts. Holy shit. You know, I'm currently, like, cleaning up. And I just realized that, um... So adding water to the silica gel releases a whole bunch of heat, making it an exothermic process. But in order to dry it out and bring it back to its original state, you have to put in a lot of heat, making it an endothermic process. So it's almost as if this is a reversible form of energy storage, which is fucking fascinating. And I hope I'm right about that. And I'm going to have to do some research and uh, we're going to have to make a lot more videos. So yeah, this concludes uh, the first attempt at a video with your boy, and uh, we boiled a plant on accident, but we have footage, so. Remember kids, the only difference between screwing around and science is writing it down. Alright, so um, if, if you like watching me boil plants, then uh, definitely subscribe because we're going to boil more plants. No, we're not. I might boil some plants later, but it's called tea. Yeah, throw some like suggestions for new videos in there because uh, I have some ideas, but not a lot. And I like making videos. Bye. Applesauce is good.